hello 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 welcome back to divine destiny guide i'm back with another uplifting and inspirational message for you from god's lips to my ears to you i love to do these for us i love doing these for you for us and if this is your first time i welcome you returning soul drivers new soul drivers thank you thank you thank you so very much merry christmas seasons greetings to you and yours wherever you are may the love the peace and joy of divine flows in you through you radiate all over you knowing you are blessed you are highly highly favored and you are mm, protected to the maximum knowing that again god is for you who can be against you you are on top we are on top and we are only getting higher so I thought I would do this one since it's coming up Christmas is almost here so it's like what what are your gifts you know when you show up in the lives of others what is it that you bring to your your friends maybe people in your past your job all of that what is it that you bring and so without any further ado the first card here is the unexpected mentor unexpected mentor so a lot of you is like people didn't see you coming for for some of you you're underestimated until people realize how smart you are how much wisdom you have to share for some of you you are a mentor so people look to you for guidance as well to be directed maybe in your own family your circle maybe some of you your influencers you have platforms in your workplace in your everyday life maybe you know on the job you're mentoring others as well but you are the one that people least expected because it says here you are the unexpected mentor again here she is very plain not a lot of makeup so people may kind of take your quietness your your purity for weakness and then they are like wow they're blown away at how much you know how wise you are wow keep going keep going it's your perseverance is your ability to be non-stop you're a force to reckon with i mean here he is putting up the shield is like come hell or high water you are prepared for the journey and it doesn't matter what discouragement maybe some of you you cheer people on you encourage people to keep going as well you yourself you are unstoppable you you don't you don't just give up or give in easily so this is this is a gift that you bring to the table you're a warrior you're a fighter it's like you come prepared you come in peace but you're prepared for war yeah affirmations so a lot of you you say positive affirmations again you encourage others the gift you have is like people will say how is it that you're able to manifest things into your life it's because you're a manifester and with the sword here I'm sorry if you hear a noise outside but with the sword here it's like the truth you have clarity it's like you know that there is no mountains high enough you know that with God with the divine all things are possible for you and again it's like you're armed you're armed you may not look like it but you're prepared for the challenge you're prepared for the task ahead so you use a lot of affirmations positive affirmations in your life you probably encourage people to do the same and then love will endure so what 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 gift do you bring what are your gifts love will endure you are loving you're caring some of you you're probably in health care as well you don't give up on the people you love you don't walk away you're very loyal it's like to the end you are that ride or die you're that faithful partner it reminds me of the titanic ship you know and your love will go on and on it doesn't matter what so for some of you 
you stay connected to your family, your friends, your partnership, even until their dying day, you're very supportive. Commune with your powerful animal, eyes of the jaguar. So a lot of you, your gift is that you're fierce. For a lot of you, and again here, when I see the eyes, it's like you're just so determined, so focused on whatever it is. It's like you're able to channel whatever. For some people, it could be the lion, like here. You know, it could be the jaguar. It's whatever it is, animal, spirit, that is like when it comes to it, you can bring it out. It doesn't matter how shy you are, but it's almost like you're able to channel that that energy, that spirit, when you are fearful in order to accomplish whatever it is that you need to, to do. It's like that song by Katy Perry, The Eye of the Tiger. You are driven, you're focused. For a lot of you, your eyes, very beautiful. People admire them as well. Wow. Okay, for some of you, you're able to remember your past, but you stay in the present. This is your gift. So even for your ancestors, your past on loved ones, sometimes you may even go down memory lane, but you're able to pick up and move on in the future because you know that's what they would want. So you don't hold on to the past. That's the gift that you have. You're able to stay in the present, in the moment, to enjoy the moment, to celebrate the here and now. Well, and you probably encourage people to do so as well. You're able to, to, to hold your wisdom close. So a lot of you, yes, you're very wise, like we saw with the mentor card there. You're like the sage. You've gone through a lot through your experiences, and you're wiser. You're very intelligent. Again, you mentor others. You help to lead others. You're an inspiration to others. That's the gift that you bring. Wow, this is beautiful. I love it for you. I love it for us. Okay. retreat to avoid conflict yeah that's a gift that you bring is that you're able to go into your quiet place you're not afraid to it's like why go to war where there is no spoil it's like you you don't compete where you don't compare either and so if people are trying to bring conflict to your door you'll just step back if people in your life are trying to or maybe even in your past where people try to compare you with others then you just tell them you know what if you think that person those people are better for you go ahead but I'm not going to compete with anybody and so you will just go by yourself to avoid conflict so you're a peaceful person you're a person of peace it's like your peace is very important you're not going to compare yeah go your own way absolutely go your own way you're not afraid to travel your own path again you know that god you know your angels look they are with you you are protected so you're not afraid to step out on your own 45 that's nine endings bring new beginnings so you're not afraid to put an end to what no longer serves you and so you move on. You're able to go your own way, stand on your own, if, if you have to, for some of you. For some of you, you're exploring new territory. Yeah. For some of you, you may be traveling. We have the ship here. You're maybe thinking. So you're not afraid to go out, to do things on your own, by yourself as well. It's like you're always setting your mind on something new, something to do. What else, what you can do is like you're, you're interested in expansion. That's you. I mean, look at, look at the skull, look at the head, how, how elongated. 
how large it is. You're very creative. You have brilliant ideas. You are somebody who think outside of the box. You're always looking for new opportunities, how you can grow, how you can expand, where to start another business, how to start another business. That's what you are. That's your gift. And again, a lot of you, you are able to share these with people as well. You may even encourage people to do these things. You give them ideas. You're able to show love and compassion. So we see here too, with the love will, will endure. Some of you, you're, you're earth angels. Some of you, you're in the medical field. You're healers. You're light workers. So you are very compassionate, very caring people, very loyal as well. And for, for a lot of you, your gift, you show up in people's life on time, just when they need you. You are, you are, you are a source of inspiration for a lot of people. And here, the last card, it says a quest for change. So for a lot of you, again, yeah, change. You're not afraid to change. And we saw that with exploring new territories. Change, that is us. You're not afraid to go out to challenge the status quo, even though you're a fixed sign, but you're open to new possibilities, new potentials, if it means that it's going to be for your, for your good, for your family. So it's like you're always looking out on the horizon for what's next, a quest, a journey, your soul searching. You want to go out on an adventure. And so even for some of you, when spiritual, and the last card at the back here, it says, it says, look for the portal, look for the portal. I'm sorry, but that's confirmation. But for a lot of you, you are going, you're not afraid to go beyond, even to search um, on your quest in your spirituality to learn more about God. So this is, this is good. I love this for you. I love this for us. So thank you so very much. Until next time, remember to like, share, and subscribe. Take care. God bless.